advertising revenue has been plummeting, but London's red buses just got a quarter million dollar bonanza from a very unusual source. No, not from the church, from those who reject it, atheists. There's probably no God, enjoy your life, is the latest in-your-face message to cross the city. It's not exactly catchy, but Ariane Shireen and others hope it will catch on. I'm kind of hoping not to convert people, but just to make people think a little, uh, make them smile on the way to work. The comedy writer came up with the idea when she wrote a blog criticizing evangelical advertising on buses. I was told that all non-Christians, which includes me, are going to go to hell and burn there for all eternity. It's just the kind of scaring people to religion that I, I take exception to. But she never expected to get the backing of scientist Richard Dawkins and enough money for ads on 800 buses and the underground. The biggest surprise is what little anger it's generating. Church of England leaders have welcomed the open debate on faith. And it spurred similar campaigns in Washington, D.C. and Spain. But what do ordinary people think? I wouldn't exactly say I'm an atheist myself, but uh, I, think, I think it's time that, uh, that um, that image was out at the same time. What do you think about that ad? It's not right. It's not true. A little more tolerance would be a good idea. Well, I'm not keen on it at all, really. In Britain, only a third consider themselves Christian, and even fewer go to church. So the ads may be good for business, but they're unlikely to change minds. Amy Gutman, CBS News, London.